Communications, may I help you? Uh, yeah, sure. I was talking about this uh, new uh, gay and lesbian channel. Uh, what's up with that? What's the deal with that? It's just a channel for people who are interested and want to be educated about the gay perspective. Oh, really? Well, it seems to me like the gay perspective would mostly be like a, a couple of big hairy b dangling in front of your face. Sir? I would even go as far as to say that a gay man down on all fours with his lover jackhammer in his backside probably has a very limited perspective, you know. Like Sir? The floor or the headboard. That's not what the Gay and Lesbian channel is all about. Well, why don't you feel me again? It will feature education shows and documentaries that emphasize the positive role gays play in our society. Documentaries? Do you, do you really think the average homosexual can, can stop s***ing dick long enough to watch a documentary? I mean, please, let's get real. <laughs> Okay. Morning, Communications may help you. Look, uh, I'm just trying to, to gauge where this gay channel is coming from. I mean, will there be specialty shows like, like the gay outdoors and stuff like that? That's very possible. That's very realistic. Like a couple of queers could sit in a duck blind for five hours without having any sex with each other. Sir, this is not what the gay and lesbian channel is. Blow on this duck call, boy. Good morning, for communications. May I help you? Yes, we uh, seem to have been disconnected. Um, is is there going to be news on this gay channel? Sir, I'm really not sure about that yet. Because, you know, I really don't think there's a need for news, sports, and weather from a gay perspective. I mean, look, we all know gay men are very promiscuous. What are you talking they don't about? give a shit about whether it's going to rain or not. They're interested in the seven-day forecast for getting their dicks. Communications may help you. Yeah, look, Missy, I, I've been doing some thinking about this year, a gay network. Sir. Yes. Please, quit calling. What's your name? My name is Ned, and I'm very interested in this gay network. You see, if you're going to do it, you might as well do it right. Are you gay? Ned. My sexuality has absolutely no bearing on the subject. Uh, now, where was I? You know, if, if you're going to do it, you might as well do it right. You see, i got some good ideas for some all-gay shows. Please quit calling. Like Walker, Texas Rope Ranger. Please. The Bionic Lesbian. This Old Bathhouse. I don't have time for this. Have you ever seen Bob Vita scrubbing an 80-year-old man's ass? I have a phone to answer. <laughs> Pretty hot. Okay. i got a million of them. Here, check this one out. Instead of rawhide, it's rawhide. <laughs> Left behind. Very nice, sir. Please. Colon, 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 I'm pounding on your colon, that colon is so swollen and rhyme. Push it in, pull it out, push it in, pull it out, push it in, pull it out. Hello. Good morning, communications may help you. Yes, uh, how about this one, for the kids? HR f***ing suck. That is disgusting. Good morning, for communications may help you. Yeah, how about this one, instead of F troop, F me troop. No. Where Larry Storch battles Indians in f***ing pumps and a crutchless cavalry outfit. <laughs> it's hot. Oh, yeah. Good morning, our communications. May I help you? All right, here's a good one. I don't have time for this. Missionary impossible. You did? Ned. You get it, guys? Missionary impossible? Sir. <laughs> Just take those up to Dr. Fox. I'm hanging up now. Good morning, Communications may help you. The d*** of hazard. Bow and loop d***. Ned. A couple of gay country boys with 12-inch d***s. That is not what the gay and lesbian channel is all about. Yeah. Good morning, for communications. Here's a guaranteed surefire smash hit. Gilligan's ass. <laughs> How can I not laugh? The skipper wanted Gilligan's tail. His pants he did unzip. Ned. Big fat homo was too Ned, large. Please. He crushed little buddy's hip. <laughs> the night was a pre-op transsexual skipper. Hello. Uh, damn it. 